Hey guys, it's me, Jello Pineda, your middle class sneakerhead, and welcome back to the channel. Today's video, we're gonna be unwrapping, I guess. We're gonna be unwrapping the stuffs that I bought nung nagpunta ako ng Beyond the Culture. So, and daming, and daming clothing line, mga local brands natin na, na nagtayo ng boot doon. So, so I bought some, and uh, let's go ahead and check them out. Thank you so much for checking on this video today guys and I do hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Kung bago ka dito, please make sure that you are subscribed to my YouTube channel kasi we are still doing that 5,000 subscriber giveaway and we are giving out a Rastaklat off-white bracelet and an Adidas t-shirt. If you want to know how to join the raffle, I'll link a video here para makita mo yung mechanics on how to join. As well as lagay ko na rin sa baba para just in case di mo makalik sa taas, meron at meron pa rin tayong details sa baba. So yes, October 20th, nagpunta tayo sa... Beyond the culture, it was an amazing, amazing, amazing event. I felt that the event na yon was for YouTubers, talaga. <laughs> now, aside sa ano, uh, it it was for sneaker YouTubers and people who love sneakers, and then people who love the culture. I was very happy na to be part of or to be you know to be able to attend. Of course, a huge shout out to Sir John Salomon ng Feed Your Feet Manila for giving us access, actually giving Glenn Sumang the access and then Glenn Sumang invited, inviting me to come with him dun sa event. So anyways, I bought a few stuff. And daming mga local brands na nandun. Sila Kalawakan, Collective Drops. Actually, and dami kong gustong bilhin din. Kaso, nung nag-iikot-ikot ako dyan, ang budget ko was 2,000 pesos. Sabi ko, sa naabot ang 2,000? Ano yung mabibili ko for under 2,000 pesos? Ikot-ikot lang din ako. For sure, daw bibiling sneakers kasi nakitipid tayo. So, ending, nakabili ako ng dalawang, or di naman, apat na items. So, gusto lang din pakita sa inyo. Um, first is, first is, we got a shirt from Good Guys. Good Guys Clothing. I'll link their uh, website on the description down below just in case. Kasi makita yung mga, ano ba yung mga items nila. And yun, inside the bag, actually binigyan nila ako ng sticker yeah, yata. And then di pala <laughs> hindi pala sticker. So ayan, pero may binigay silang sticker, di ko lang sure kung sa like nalagay. So ito, ito siya, tignan natin, ano yung laman. Tons of dope dope items to to buy. Sabi mo if I had like 5,000 budget, siguro mas talagang puro mga clothing ang bibiling ko kasi it's very hard to find yung alam streetwear na medyo affordable kasi compare mo sa mga streetwear na available at the moment for example Stussy na nasa 2000 plus ang isang shirt um, tapos yung mga Santa Cruz na nasa 1000 plus to 2000 plus or diamond clothing yung mga ganun i mean maganda sila of course syempre ano sila eh streetwear brand na talaga sila eh. however alam mo iba pa rin if you're like supporting local of course sneakers bro is sa mga nag-sponsor sa akin they are also a uh, local brand so ito siya good guys it's a black shirt and so it's a plain black shirt ito siya merchant design dito Nakatawa kasi diba nagkakapa ko na napabaliktad. So, ayan siya. Ayan ang design niya sa harapan. Nothing sa taas. Pero when you flip it over, makikita mo yung good guys na shirt sa likod. I mean, good guys na na print dito sa likod. Well, material, it's it's a black shirt. But it doesn't really matter. What matters is, syempre yung ano, yung, what matters is yung print. Diba? Good guys. So, ang ganda. It's white and orange. Although, I don't have a lot of orange shoes. Pero, Alam mo yun, still, I bought the shirt for 600 pesos. Yeah, 600 pesos. Alright, and then next on the list or next on the things that I picked up sa event was... Huh, hindi siya t-shirt. It's a... I got a lace, leather lace from Lace Swap Project. So, nakikita ko lagi sa Instagram to kaso hesitant ako dahil may shipping. So, nung nakita ko doon, ay bibili na ako na isa. So, kumuha ako ng leather, uh, leather red na lace na merong gold aglets. So, actually, ito talagang, ang intention ko dito was for Jordan 1 uh, na ano, Jordan 1 na uh, black to low. Kasi napakaganda ng datingan niya kapag naka leather lace siya na, black, na, na red eh. At ito, this one would fit yung uh, black toe. So, ayan. I got this one for 350 pesos. And the length is 52. Uh, FYI, uh, if you are looking for laces for your Jordan 1 lows, 52 inches. Or 52, basta 52 ang size niya. 
Alright? As well as nilink ko na rin si Laiswa Project ang kanyang details, social media sa baba. Just in case, interesado kong umorder ng kanilang mga laces. Alright, so next on the list, next on the list na uh, ano, na binili ko. Of course, the inner hype beast is uh, talking to me. So, bumili ako. Actually, ginamit ko na eh. Ginamit ko na sa event. So, bumili ako ng isang mask from above the ankle. Ayan. Matagal ko na talagang gusto bumili ng mask. Kaso, di ko lang sure kung ano yung magandang brand or something. Then, uh, syempre alam ko naman sa uh, above the ankle meron. So, nung sa event, that was the time na talagang alam ko makakabili na ako ng mask. They had uh, three different colors. Itong woodland camo, tapos yung camo na white and gray, tapos yung black. Supposedly, black lang kukunin ko kasi para at least hindi siya dumihin. However, I would want something that really pops. So, parang... You know? Oh. Ginamit ko na sa event habang ano kasi sobrang gusto ko talaga siyang subukan. So, it's made out of parang neoprene material tapos meron siyang uh, patch na above the ankle logo dito. And I got this for 450 pesos. Maganda to and yung... Actually, yung tatlong design maganda naman eh. So, mamili ka lang ako na mas strip mo. And then, kung kukuha man ako na isa pa yung black na para sure ball kahit anong suot mo, ay humahype beast ka na. At... Alright, and of course, last on the list. Last on the list is a t-shirt from Above the Ankle. Supposedly, bibili ako ng pants kasi on dala ko lang budget pang bilaw was 2,000. Eh, gusto ko medyo makarami. So, bumila ako shirt. So, this is a t-shirt from Above the Ankle. And this one is a very, 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 very special na shirt. This one is a commemorative t-shirt for Boss Rabi, the founder, the owner of Above the Ankle. So, ito siya. It has Above the Ankle uh, logo here sa harapan. And then, when, if you flip it over, yung image ni Boss Rabi. Ayan siya. And I got a large, large ba to? Oh, large to. Sakto na sa akin to. And then, naganda ng card niya, oh. Above the Ankle, Above the Ankle Company. So, yun. Again, ililink ko pa rin ang ano. Ililink ko pa rin down below yung, um, yung details ni Above the Ankle just in case gusto buhay. Although, pants talaga ang hinahabol ko. Ang ganda ng mga pants nila. Ito, pakita ko sa'yo. Ito yung mga pants nila nakita ko. Merong mga camo, merong mga may string sa baba, baggy na, uh, bagi na maraming pockets. Gusto talaga ko muna isa. However, again, yung budget ko was just for uh, shirts. Pero then again, syempre, isa pa rin yung sa mga grill na, ano, grill na uh, shirts or uh, grill na pants na bibilin ko in the near future. So, yan. So, yes, actually, gusto ko lang i-share sa inyo kung yung mga pinamili ko. And then, sila Glenn, sila Glenn Sumang nga. Sila Glenn Sumang, nurse lagalag. Talagang pag nakita lang, bumibili. Ay, bumili na naman siya. Nag, hindi ka na nag-vlog, nag-shopping ka na. Kapag sa mga ganyang klaseng event, hindi ko may iwasan, hindi bumili kahit isa or dalawang items lang. Kasi nandiyan ka naman eh. Kung baga parang remembrance. I do hope you guys like this, our shopping haul. Shopping haul eh, no? Apat na peraso lang, shopping haul. Ay, by the way, the t-shirt, this one cost um, 800 pesos for uh, t-shirt ni Sir Rabi. So, ayun. Kung di mo pa nakita yung video na ginawa ko about Above the Culture, gumawa ko ng parang SDE type alagay ko dito sa taas. And then, as well as, syempre, gagawa din ako ng vlog or gumawa na ako ng vlog. I'm not sure kung ano mauna ito ba or yung vlog. So, syempre, yung vlog kung ano yung nangyari uh, on the day, uh, yung like yung experience ko nung nagpunta ako doon. So, ginawa ko talaga separate videos talaga. Um, merong SDE, merong vlog, tas pangatlotong shopping hall, and then lastly would be abangan nyo na lang kung ano yun. Pero anyways, again, kung bago ko dito, make sure that you are subscribed to my YouTube channel. Click na rin yung notification bell para just in case meron tayong bagong upload, kitang kita mo or manonotify ka kaagad. Kung matagal ka na rito, tol, thank you very much for your support. Lahat ng mga nagpa-picture, lahat ng mga mga bumati sa akin dyan sa Beyond the Culture, sobrang nakakataba ng puso. I'm very overwhelmed and I'm very thankful Basta, you, you guys are the best. So, yun. Anyways, maraming maraming salamat for checking on this video today, guys. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace, guys.